and welcome to Winnipeg. He's Ray Ferraro. I'm James Cebulski. Ray is all evened up, but not for long when this one is finally settled here tonight. No, huge game in the series. You want to get yourself into the lead. You want to be aggressive, not timid. But every player knows the importance of this contest that's about to begin. We are about set to drop the puck as both centers make their way into the dock. You can feel the intensity of this one. Total playoff atmosphere. We're underway. The Avalanche have gained possession off the wall. A chance in front! Off a stick. Picked up along the wall by Wheeler. The Jets take the puck through the neutral zone. Winnipeg's got the puck against the boards. Lugs the puck into the offensive zone corner. Hammers one at the net. Close, but not close enough. Comes up with the stop. Dead center. Excellent save. The Avs played along the wing. Just a simple save by Hellebuck. Shifley's won the draw deep in the defensive zone. Grabbed along the board by Line. Through center along the wing. Here's a chance, a two-on-one. Stopped by the goaltender. He scores! Jumps on the rebound and makes it count. He's got a battle into position here. Gets underneath the defenseman and puts it over the glove into the net. If the fans were just thinking they were going to watch along, well, they're jazzed now. They've got the early lead, and they're up on their feet. Cops got it in the offensive zone. With some momentum driving towards the net, with the stop. And now it's grabbed by Connor. Sends it quickly to Pionk. Pionk's dangerous, and he's got the puck now. He had to go ahead goal earlier on. Taken along the wall by Connor. And now he moves it quickly to Pionk. Under all sorts of pressure, trying to protect the puck. Colorado's on the attack. Rips it just wide. Probably better off to take a little off the shot and get it on target. He's nowhere near the net. Winnipeg's got a hold of it along the wall. Over the line they come. Takes that pass back at the point. Here's a shot. Nothing doing. The Jets gain control of the puck against the wall. Handles the puck at the point. Rips it on the redirect. Picked up along the boards by Ehlers. Oh, I love the way they played this shift. They protected the puck well, but now they've got it and they can run around the zone. The defenders can't chase them. They're too tired. Completely misses on the play. You don't even make the goalie work here. You've got to make him have to do something in the net. Slide scores! Well, the game back to level now. Anybody that's had a lead, the lead is gone, and now we're evened up again. I think the goalie whiffs on this. He looks like he wants to get a stick on it. It's low on that side, but he doesn't make the stop. time left in the period as we approach the midway mark the next goal could be a big one as we are tied Colorado's won the draw tosses it on to Comper pass back to the point time of the goal takes the pass puck grabbed by Bork he carries the puck up along the wing dumps it in Winnipeg's gained possession along the boards. Moves the puck inside the offensive zone. The Jets get a hold of the puck. 
Denied by the goaltender. Grabs control of it at the point. Back at the point, they set it up. Morrissey's going to play it against the half wall. Oh, I like this, James. They've really cycled the puck well on this shift. Now they can hold it, and you put the pressure on the defenders. Eventually, they pull you down, or you get a great chance. And he gets the puck right back. Reaches out and pokes it away. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. Puck scooped up by Burakovsky. With the blast, and comes up empty. Winnipeg's got a hold of it against the wall. Scoops up the puck now. Slides the puck across to Lowry. Lowry's got it against the boards. Fires it. Turns it away on the slap shot. Moves it to Landeskog. Colorado's got the puck along the wall. Centering pass. The Jets get a hold of the puck in their own end. Nice pass. Heads to the back of the net. Handles it along the blue line. And that's blocked. Puck picked up by Comfort. Tries to get it to Landeskog. There's the whistle from the linesman calling it offside. Just here in the late stages of this frame, you can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. Taken by Graves. Slides it to McKinnon. Colorado's got it along the wall. Slides the puck over. Blocked in front. In front, the puck stopper gets on top, but we'll get a little stoppage in play here, Ray. Yep, goalies are going to jump on it as quick as they can anytime around the front of the net. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Oh, and he had the whole corner. As the goalies have gotten better and better, you have to deliver it quick. Sometimes you just miss. Here's a shot and makes a save. Big play inside the defensive zone. The Avalanche have gained control of the puck along the wall. And he slides it quickly to McKinnon. Nearing the final 60 seconds here this first period. And there's the save. Nice move by the goalie to get out close to the shooter. Sends it across. Gives them nothing in front. Scooped up along the wall by Roslevic. And now it's over to Wheeler. Comes up with the steal. And that'll do it for period number one. All evened up at one goal apiece. Just a friendly reminder about tonight's silent option. All items can be viewed and bid upon at the display near the guest services counter. Second period still to come. We'll take a quick pause and be right back with more action. Just moments away from the start of period number two. Period number two now underway. Let's see what this one has in store for us. Well, this one underway. Ray, give us an update on what your assessment is to this point. Winnipeg's focus going forward is going to be to hold on to the puck much better than they did in that turnover-prone first period. With possession along the wall. Here's a chance right in the slot. Picked up along the wall by Line. The Avs gain possession along the wall. Moves it quickly over to Rantanen. On the attack along the boards. Takes a shot. Big time stop there. Moves the puck over to Wheeler. Wheeler's carrying it ahead. Takes a shot. Off the mask of the goaltender. Boy, right between the eyes. Uh, we used to laugh about this and say, oh, the goalie's got to answer the phone because his ears are going to be ringing but I'm sure the trainer's going to check on him here as this hits him right in the face oh and another look at that oh yeah here it is oh yeah good work guys good work Brannigan getting this thing right what a stop by the goaltender back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone quick pass to Pionk moves it around along the half wall here's a shot sails over the net 
just misses the net, but really the scoring chance is not dangerous if you can't get the puck at the goaltender. Moves the puck across to Donskoy. Winnipeg's got the puck behind the net. Ehlers moves it into the attacking end. Here's a shot denied by the goaltender. Still lots of time left in the period. It's all tied up. Back underway, and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. Flash from the point! Brilliant save, read it perfectly. as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone and makes the save. Colorado's got possession at center. Along the half wall with the puck. Chris one in close. Misses a golden opportunity there. Oh, he's got to get that on target. That's a scoring chance and he doesn't even make a, the goaltender make a save. Takes the feed. Connor's got the puck. Looks to set up at the point now. Stopped by the goaltender. Passes the puck over to Burakovsky. Moves the puck along the half wall. Shot off target. Grabbed along the board by Zadorov. Oh, and he just puts it wide of the net. And now it's grabbed by Burakovsky. Long jam in front. That's broken up. Let's it go. And that one's stopped. Kinnon's won the face-off deep inside the offensive zone. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Puck grabbed by Rantanen. Sends it out right in front! The Jets look to start the transition game. Bork's got it on the offensive end. Takes the feed at the point. Moves the puck. Scores! And he puts his team in front! Enough room to get this up over the goalie's blocker on the stick side high. Beats him clean. Winnipeg's hard work pays off. They've gone up by one here in this second period. Even though it really shouldn't matter, it does change the way you play the game. Now that you're in the lead, you can dictate the pace of the game. Sends a pass over. Shot denies him on the play. Taken along the wall by Landeskog. Oh, he comes up with a stop as he got the glove on it. Yeah, he's pretty good positioning here, James. He makes the two stops back to back. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Puts it on net for the point. Tripped up on the play. Delayed penalty coming up. Let's get the official decision. Officials calling tripping here on this one. This was the penalty I think when I took. I was most angry at myself because you're not trying to do it. And then all of a sudden you see the guy go down and you're just like, ah, oh, man, here I go. There's the result. The Jets will have a chance to get on the power play for the first time this evening. Here's their first power play of the night, James, and they can be patient on it. They want to get the good shot, not just start firing puck after puck at the net. Ehlers has the puck against the half wall. And they can't convert to the play. Here's a blast from the boards. Puck scooped up by Perot. Nowhere for that shot to go through. Man, they've worked the puck around so well on this shift. They've totally worn out the defending team. About two things are going to happen here, it seems like. They're going to either take a penalty or they're going to give up a goal. This is a great shift. More than half the period has gone by. Hope you're enjoying this one. It's 2-1. Comfers won it off the faceoff. Gets it out of his own end. The Jets can't convert to the power play. Both sides are back to even strength. 
Well, they'll have to regroup after that. The power play doesn't cash in. Opportunity lost for them. Winnipeg's lead here in the second period, a direct result of being the more aggressive team offensively. Kadri's won the draw here in the neutral zone. They've got the defense outnumbered. Just wide. Picked up along the boards by Girard. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. Connor's got it into offensive territory. With possession along the wall. Into the corner of the attacking area. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. Scooped up along the wall by Connor. Puck picked up by Kadri. Gaining momentum up along the side. Ahead of steam now towards the front. And that one's turned away. I like the goalie's positioning here. He was aggressive enough to make a save on a dangerous chance. Line A sliding the puck behind the net. Off the stick. That's in a dangerous spot. He makes a good save here. The Jets have it in the offensive end. Second period nearly into its final minute here. Takes it across the blue line. Moved to the middle. Snaps it on net. Denies him. Wheeler's got it along the wing. Shoots it. Oh, some fans thought that was in, but that went off the side of the net. And that's all she wrote on period number two in this one. 2-1 two -one is where things sit after 40 minutes. It's time to support those around us with a monthly food drop. Bring three non-perishable food items, and you can receive a free team poster. The third period is just moments away. And both Ray and I will be ready to bring you all the action here on EA Sports. And we are just moments away from the start of the third period. Here we go, put up or shut up for both teams here in this third period. We are underway. Ray, with two periods in the books, what are your thoughts on the game to this point? Colorado's got to find some energy here. The game's close, but they haven't had very many shots on goal. You're not going to score like that. Shifley swooping in on the attack. Blistering shot! That goes wide. Gains control of the puck here at the blue line. Let's it fly. Comes up with the stop. Slides the pass over to Landeskog. Landeskog's got it in the offensive zone. Quick feed to Rantanen. Drives it to the front of the net. Comes up with the stick save. Hellebuck save right there is an excellent one. Here's a short pass to Line. A. Big time stop. Gets a blocker on it. Gerard's got the puck through the neutral zone. Here they are on the attack. Makes the save. Taken by Pionk. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Here's a shot, and he comes up with it. On the attack along the boards. Puts it up front. Here's Whoa. the opportunity. Scores! That's back to back, Ray. Well, the game has changed. Those two goals here really have changed the other one. Quick release beats the goaltender. I think the goalie felt it. he was in the perfect position. He didn't really move too much, but just inside the post. Winnipeg's attempt to put more pucks on net has paid off as they lead it in the third. Puck has dropped, and we are back underway. Scored by number 20. Tosses it to Connor. Moves it around along the half wall. Heads deep inside the offensive zone. Grubauer's going to opt for the whistle and give everybody a chance to breathe. Sometimes you get running around as the shift gets long. This helps. Nearing the midway mark of the period, the Jets have all the momentum right now, leading by two. Nice start winning the draw here inside the offensive zone. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. Along the half wall with the puck. 
Let's it go. Scores. Three is the magic number. And that goal is getting just torched down there. Three in a row here. That's a really good shot. The goaltender's down in the butterfly. He thinks he's got mostly everything covered, but apparently not. The puck gets by him. having a lot of fun out there tonight but Ray I can imagine it's a different story on the other side of the bench yeah half the guys out here are having fun the other half this game can't end quick enough moves the puck along the half wall Colorado's got the puck inside the defensive zone Six minutes, thirty lets it fly and he makes the save picked up along the wall by Kadri moves it to Kadri Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Over the net it goes! Often you're not even really aiming this. You just want it in the top half of the net. He ends up shooting it a few inches too high. Moves it quickly over to Connor with the stop. Receives the pass. A little back and forth. With possession along the wall. With some moment, scores! Is that momentum screaming now? Well, he's whispering. If he can get another one, he'll start to scream here. They tell you it doesn't have to hit the back of the net. It's just got to get over the goal line for it to count. That one does. The goalie had a big chunk of it. Just not enough. Colorado's narrowed the gap here in the third, but still a long way to go, Red. Uh, James, this is still way down the road to even this game up. But if you get one, maybe you get another. Maybe they get nervous. On the attack along the boards. Quick pass to Bork. He gets a piece of it with a stick. Again, the denial by the goaltender. Really solid shift here. Their puck possession game has been outstanding. Now they've got it again, and they can hold it down underneath the blue line. Quick feed to Burakovsky. Burakovsky's going to play it against the half wall. Oh, you would have had that, Ferraro. Not really. I mean, I, I think <laughs> I tried the same shot, but you don't hit the net. You don't give yourself a chance. With all kinds of traffic, he grabs the puck here inside his own end. Brings the puck into the offensive end now. Bork's got it to the side. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Here's a shot! Stopped by the goaltender. Right up the gut, here they go. They've got numbers! Bork's got it against the boards. Knocked away. Colorado's got the puck in their own end. McKinnon's got the puck. Let's it go! Stopped by the goaltender. Save made by the goalie. That's why a goalie can never relax. He makes one stop. Now he's got to be sharp to make another. Slides the puck near the front of the net. Gets in front of it. In the final moments of this period, we've got ourselves a 4-2 hockey game. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Scores! Oh, the mound looks a little less steep now. They get to within one with that marker there. You hope this play will work like this. You get a face-off win. It's a quick shot, and it beats the goaltender. back with a big one here in the third important to get within one a lot of times you're sitting on the bench you look up at the clock and you can't believe 10 minutes have melted away Shifley's got it along the wing Potato's got it in the offensive zone here's a shot makes the save as he got a blocker on it get that slop out of here he makes the stop and there's no rebound off in the corner it is moves it around along the half wall Centering pass! Scores! We're all tied up! Oh, let's get to a stage in the game where you think...
think they're not going to be able to find the equalizer, but they stay at it, and they get it done. They chipped away and chipped away. It didn't seem like they were going to be able to make it all the way back, but this is a terrific comeback. essentially said to everybody buckle up as they have even things up you get into the last five minutes it becomes a crapshoot in a tie game face off here in the neutral zone and we are back underway Colorado's got possession here in the neutral zone Hellebox got it in the defensive end A lot on the line here in this offensive zone faceoff. Offensive zone faceoff, and he wins the draw. An easy save by Hellebuck. There's another stop. Yeah, he's right in front of the puck, too, so there's really nowhere that puck's going to squeak through. A big draw looming here in the offensive zone. Inside of the final minute here in the third. And that's blocked away. Colorado's got the puck along the wall. Here's a shot. Misses high. That feels like a wasted opportunity. You got to get it on target. Might have skipped up on him right before he let it go. Along the half wall with the puck. Here's a shot. Comes up with the stop. Quick pass over to Landeskog. Moves the puck along the half wall. Here's a rocket of a shot. Oh, makes the save. That was a rocket. Here's a shot being saved by the goaltender once again. Oh, I like this stop here. He makes the save. He looks in control, and the rebound's 30 to 40 feet away. Hammers one. Oh, comes up with a stop. Up along the wing. All alone. Oh, what a save on the breakaway. There are big moments in a close game, and that's one of them. period there's the horn to end period number three still deadlocked here that means overtime is coming up overtime action is just moments away stay with us Listen to this place, the electricity so thick you could cut it with a knife. Sudden death, overtime, the puck is dropped, let's go. Slides the puck to Wheeler. Carries it in. And he slides it quickly to Line. Puts the puck on net with the stop. This is a face-off. They'll definitely want to win here inside the offensive zone. Puck is dropped, and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. The Jets will play it in their own end. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Line. Takes a shot, denied by the goaltender. A critical draw here. And as the puck is dropped, they win the draw here inside the defensive zone. Johnson's got it across the line. Handles the puck. Off the glove, and the puck skips away. Takes a shot just wide of the net. Grabbed along the board by Johnson. Oh, and the goalie catches a break there. Manny snapped that right up over top of the net. He doesn't miss by much. And now it's grabbed by Gerard. There's the whistle as things will slow down here for a moment. Always a good play if you're not sure what's going on. Freeze the puck. 
A big face-off here inside the offensive end. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. And makes the save. The frozen biscuits dropped, and we are back underway here. Moves it to Donskoy. And they'll dump it in. And the goalie leaves his crease to play the puck. And now he tries to get it across to Ehlers. Here they come on the attack. Back to the blue line. Puts it towards the net, and there's the save. Colorado's got the puck along the boards. Fires it into the offensive zone. Picks up the puck in his own end. Ehlers moves it ahead. Takes the feet at the back end. There's a shot denied by the goaltender. A lot on the line here in this offensive zone faceoff. Puck is dropped and we are back underway. And now he moves it to Donskoy. Shot and makes the save. A big draw looming here in the offensive zone. Kopp won the draw deep in the defensive zone. Puck grabbed by Kopp. Looks to make a play over to Connor. Right in front of the net. There it is. There it is. They score to win it in overtime. There it is. Final horn sounds. We are all over here with this one. Huge goal in overtime. Boy, look at how it's changed the series, Ray. The win and the series lead. Puts them in a great position here. They needed to have that. Of course they do. You're in overtime. It's so sudden when the goal goes into the net. And that's a really big goal for them. Well, that closes the book on this playoff. Barn burner for Ray Ferraro. My name is James Sabalski. We will see you as the playoffs roll on towards the quest for the cup.